Um, oh, and the I first one is thing. half a cup. For this step, I guys, you just have to be very careful um, you not to burn it. yourself because the syrup is going to be hot. So we're going to do... That's sugar? Yes. Okay. And then we're going to do one lemon. And then I'm going to... You can do this separately in a pan. Mm -hmm. um, and then pour it into, into this pan, but, you know, just to save me from washing dishes, I do it directly <laughs> on this one. I like that. Yeah. Yes. I don't have to wash dishes. as many dishes, so I just That's do everything in one shot here. Wait, I cook. <laughs> How I become taller. So I'm over here. I should be bringing one of the small chairs and probably And then we're going to wet the sugar, I and it has it. to look like wet no, sand when you, before you put it on the stove. Can I throw that out? Yeah. Thank you. Everybody can put it on the mask. So we're going to mix it up. There you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That looks like sand. Yeah, it looks like wet sand, right? It smells of lemon. I know, but lemon smells so good. It does. Oh, yeah. And that what that's what brings out the flavor in the flan in the milks of the flan. Oh, the lemon. Yeah, the oh, lemon. Oh, we're making flan. Oh, you're making flan. Oh, yes. Boy, you guys are interested. Oh, I didn't say that. We're making flan, guys. Yeah. <laughs> she, 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 she wasn't here. Yeah. She was directing our traffic. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, so this boy. pan. Oh, my goodness. I'm gonna put it on the stove. Is it gonna burn? It, it will, well, the, sh the lemon keeps the sugar from burning, okay. so it doesn't taste like burnt sugar. It'll oh. taste like a syrup. Oh. And then while that's cooking, we're going to... Maple syrup or one. So what kind of, like, heat do you put it on? It's kind of uh, like medium, medium. Yeah, that's yeah, what I was going to say. But make medium. sure, have your glove on Okay. Hands. If you're not using, like, a pan. Mm -hmm. And you just leave it. It'll start by itself. It'll start okay. melting, and then you come back to it and... <laughs> <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> All right, so now. Oh, tell them where you get your eggs from. These are from my backyard. I said the chickens are <laughs> <my heart>. yeah. <laughs> How many do you get a day, or is it how often do they lay eggs? Um, each chicken lays one egg a day. Every 24 okay. hours, you I get one. I watched a chicken lay oh, wow. an egg before when I was wow. here. They slow down in the winter time. Okay. Yeah, they do. Okay. And so then, well, here there. in this area, I have For lunch, eggs slow down. <laughs> Becky's like, where are my eggs? <laughs> <laughs> so how many eggs do we put in? We eight eggs. Eight eggs. That, that's a lot. Yes. I'm making a big uh, recipe. You can do half of the recipe. Oh, and then geez. just use a smaller pan or the same size pan. This one, this pan I'm using is an eight-inch pan. So if you do half the recipe, I'll, I recommend um, a six-inch Um but you can use the eight-inch pan as well. It, you'll just get like a thinner flan. My arm hurts, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. right. So we've got the eight eggs, and make sure your eggs are room temperature mm -hmm. because cold eggs are hard to whip by hand. Can you have to refrigerate the eggs? eggs, 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 eggs no, you don't. Yeah, right? yeah, no. If you're gonna use them right away, you don't have to. You don't have to go in the refrigerator. No. Yeah. And yeah. The reason why the eggs at the supermarket go into the refrigerator is because um, they are, they're clean. You're not really supposed to, they're clean. So they're washed, they're, they're washed. So every egg has like an, like a fresh egg has like a coating of, it's kind of like a, a Membrane, the membrane, yeah, yeah it's, it's like watery on the outside, mm -hmm. but then it then dries. Mm -hmm. When you wash it, your your egg is exposed to bacteria. Uh, yeah. Like, no, you're supposed to keep them out. Yeah. 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 I, I forgot I, the best I, one. I have to clean mine because yeah. my husband is cookie. I think your husband would get along with my husband. Uh, <laughs> probably. It bothers me because I really don't want to clean them. Yeah. I, mean, I have to clean them because of him. Yeah. Do you have chickens in your No, no, I buy chickens from no. my friends. Okay. And, um, yeah, so I have that problem. I right. clean them, but I try to keep so much time. Oh, so the sugar is cooking. Oh, my God. Wait, what does it text eggs. Oh, really? Like Hi, Mirth. Someone it, named Rachel, like them? Rachel uh -huh. yeah, is watching? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I just add a pinch of salt for oh. flavor. Okay. 
And then I add the vanilla extract. I add it to the egg. I use, because I bake and I sell my baked goods, um, I use Madagascar but bourbon vanilla extract. This is very expensive. It's like gold. <laughs> I use, I, I'm very careful how much I use it. Yeah. I think like four ounces of that vanilla costs like $16. So it's really expensive. Yeah, it's a Yeah. So now we turn it off. And then we just swirl it around. Swirl sugar. Yeah. So it's an amber color and it smells. You can smell it. It smells a little. It's a smell that I smelled before, but I forgot what it is. But I, that smell of lemon, like yeah. cooking, yeah. Yeah, you can, you can smell it smells really good. Nice. So this is and the color you want. You want like a dark amber color. Okay. <laughs> I'm already eating this. So this is a fun scene yeah. from like the beginning. Yeah. So you like, let oh, let it cool. <laughs> so are those pans like restaurant grade, or you get them at? No, the actually, regular? that's a Wilton pan oh, okay. that you can buy at Michael's. Oh. Yeah, and in my giveaway, I have a small oh. section pan, so if you guys win, <laughs> you guys will get a little pan. All right, so now the first milk I add is the condensed milk because it's thicker. Condensed milk is the best milk in the world. Yes. yes. Oh, that looks so good. Looks, looks like caramel. This is two <laughs> cans of milk. It looks like caramel. How many cans is it? Two. I have. Yeah. How does that come out? It comes out the same. You know what binds everything together is the eggs. That's what keeps everything together. So if you, for, by, I've used, you know, coconut milk for this recipe instead okay, of evaporated so, milk. Okay. Yeah. Does it taste it's different? Enough. No, it tastes the same. I know, because I put coconut milk in like a shake. Yeah. I'm like, oh, it's going to taste coconut. Mm -hmm. You don't really, really taste really it, yeah. It. I was disappointed. I wanted, it. <laughs> I wanted it to taste like coconut. Well, fun fact about coconut milk and almond milk, you have to check the ingredients because sometimes it's just water and flavor. Okay. And and like an emulsifier to thicken it. So you always have to check the ingredients when you buy like coconut milk or almond, right. almond milk. But this one obviously didn't have flavor because it didn't taste like yeah. coconut. Yeah. <laughs> but that's Four good. Four people are watching. Sure. Okay. Milka, can I? Can I no, take the blender? Oh, God. You could do it in the blender. Um, I do it by hand just because I've tried it in the blender and you get a more denser... Plan. Um, it's not bad. Uh, it's easy. You just throw everything in the blender and <laughs> it still tastes the same. Um, but like I said, I like it because of the creaminess. Like I like doing it by hand. Okay. Now that wick is whisk, excuse me, is really big. Mine is about half the size. Would that make a difference or no? Okay. No, yeah, it's just easier. Um, so when you guys make the recipe, like I'll recommend starting with half of the recipe, mm -hmm. and then if you want a bigger flan, you know, you make the whole recipe. If you want to try it out at first. Yeah. <laughs> the only thing that do worse than cook is bake, so we'll see how this goes. Well, this is easy. It's just putting all these milks together, and then you put it in the pan. I think the hardest part... Milk? This is just evaporated, evaporated milk. milk. Yeah. This is two milk cans evaporated. of evaporated milk and two cans of condensed milk. Which one do you prefer? Um, what brand? I like the... Uh, you know what? I've used store brand, and it tastes the same. Like I don't, I don't, I don't have a preference in brand. Um, the only store brand I've actually used is Shoprite store brand. I've never tried any other. Okay. <laughs> so, but this is they carnation. Milk too. Yeah, yes, yes. Carnation. these are both carnation milk. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. All right, and then that's it. You're done. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Now so now, <laughs> now you can. Yeah. <laughs> Now we're gonna pour this into the pan with the sugar. Ooh, that sizzle though. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't matter if the sugar's still hot, like that doesn't affect it. Ooh, sizzle. Video, video, making a video, making it. So the okay. trick to making a creamy flan, or I guess any kind of custard baked good. Custard. Is that you have to, it's called a water bath. So you pour the, so this is how you make cheesecakes as well. In Spanish, mm -hmm. how do you call it? Baño Maria. Mm -hmm. Baño Maria. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So you put, it, and okay, to make a, a nice cheesecake, you also it's need to do a water bath. Um, so we're, all I'm going to do is add water and then put it in the, in the oven from, from Does here. Does the water boil? And then after this, I'm going to let it bake for an hour 
and then I'm going to turn the oven off and I'm going to leave it in the oven. Okay. I'll, I'll leave it in the so oven. So did you mix it when you poured it in or just poured it in the, the sugar? Mm -hmm. No, I don't, you don't mix it. Don't okay. Mix it. Yeah, okay. you just pour it on top of the sugar. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, because the milk, like yeah, the, the batter will cook, um, but the sugar won't cook more because of the water bath. If you didn't do a water bath, you would probably have like a burnt flavor of sugar because the sugar will keep cooking. Okay. So it's kind of like, um, think of it a lot as if you were putting it in a crock pot okay. or something like that. Like it's more of a circulation of, of air and water. Yeah, it's like cooking by steam, pretty much. Exactly. Steam cooking. Yeah, because I think Harold puts the water just in a pan, but in the oven, not like that. Yeah. And I try to use a deep pan so that I can get more water, because more water equals more steam. Mm -hmm. So, oh, so you just, how much water do you want to put in? As much as you can. Um, is it half? Temperature? Maybe like halfway. Yeah, okay. Like you could do less. Like That's fine, too. 350. Now get your action. Just like go close, but don't touch. In the shot. I'm going to prepare myself for the water. <laughs> So I'll do like two cups. Two cups like that. Mm. Two cups like that. Mm -hmm. And a Pokemon cup. Cause Pokemon cups. <laughs> Pokemon cups. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna let this cook for an hour. And then like I said before, after an hour, I'm going to let it rest in the oven. I'll turn the oven off and then I'll let it rest. And that's it. Um, you could leave it for an hour, half an hour, two hours. It's okay. It doesn't. It won't overcook. Like it won't cook too much. And like I said, I know the three hundred and fifty degrees. Yeah. No, no, no. I have a show. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you so much. Hands. Hands out papers. Thank you. And then I'll also have the recipe on my website. Oh, great. Yeah. Yeah. oh thank you. All right. <laughs> and that's it, guys. <laughs> is it snow? Is it whatever is white? It's sugar. It's sugar. I want to have the whole thing. I just want to go. Oh, yes. I don't and did it. I what degrees to put the oven on. Okay. You're still alive? Oh, I'm okay.